Good morning. So good to see you this morning. Today, I want to praise God with you for our Pacific Northwest rivers. It rains so much here, but one great advantage is that we have a lot of rivers. And this morning, I went on a walk and I brought back some river rock. So these are fresh from the side of the river where uh, people like to go. And some of you last week went to the Columbia River for a picnic. Anyone do that? Some of you did. So much fun to go to by the, our big river. The Columbia River is so big. It's giant. Big ships travel up and down that river. And you can sit there and enjoy the views of the beautiful Columbia River. And last weekend, I went on a different river. I went on the Kalama River. And I went whitewater kayaking or whitewater rafting down the river with big, big white water that was pushed up from all the flow of water and the rocks under the water. And we saw a seal jump into the water. We were like, whoa, this is crazy. I love our rivers. Now, there's another river called the Lewis River. Anyone been, been to the Lewis River? Yeah, guess what we're doing this summer with the Pathfinder group. Mr. Bryson and Mrs. Bryson are going to help us go float down the river this summer on the Lewis River. So it's going to be a whole lot of fun. So I can't wait for that. And there's something else also happening this summer with a ministry that I'm a part of. It's called Upstream Camp. Anyone been to Upstream Camp before? Yeah, here, you can hold this up if you want to. An Upstream Camp is happening in June this summer, and it's for families, for kids who want to go to the East Fork Lewis River. There's another river. And there at the East Fork Lewis River, we have about 40 acres all to ourselves, and we learn how sometimes we don't float downstream, but we're called to go upstream because sometimes the values of the world are causing us to float down the wrong direction. We got to go up to the source, up to where Jesus is. And so there, parents gather together and students gather together and have a great week of discipleship. So that's happening this summer. I'm so thankful for our rivers. You know, I want to share a quick scripture with you. It's in Genesis 2. It says this. In Eden, it says, A river flowed from the land of Eden, watering the garden. God made a river in Eden, in heaven. In e well, I was here on earth. He made this river. And then just a few verses down, it says, that God caused man to fall into a deep sleep and he brought the woman out of the man. And I believe it was right next to the river with the gentle flowing water. That's where God made man and woman and all of creation. Do you praise God for rivers? Amen. I do too. There's so many life lessons that we can have from these rivers. Our lives are like rivers. They flow down and God directs them. That's beautiful. You may go back to your seats.